Over seven and a half thousand miles separate Fort Drum, New York and Lusaka, Zambia. Soldiers from the 10th Mountain Infantry Division made the long trip to participate in Zambat 4, which brought together multiple countries for a unique training experience. Typically as an infantry lieutenant, you're expe or expecting to go to like do something a little more kinetic, like go to Iraq or Afghanistan. So I, I saw this as definitely like a once in a lifetime opportunity to do something different than what was I anticipating, so. It's definitely an eye opener to see how our, well one, with our tactics compared to other nations, and then two, how easy um, it's adaptable between the nations and uh, the Zambians in general. They're a very good uh, force and they ultimately have so much pride, just as much pride as we have in our nation, so that shows in their training. Military instructors from multiple countries work side by side to train the Zambians on everything from marksmanship to cordon and search procedures. Uh, my favorite part about this whole training is uh, probably just the experience of being in Africa, uh, training international soldiers, working alongside the British, French, uh, to see them progress from uh, what we started on, which was disassembling a weapon um, and into culminating events like FTXs and live fires. Hey, troops. How many women? I mean, I think it's been fantastic. It's definitely a once in a lifetime experience. I was very fortunate enough to be invited to attend. Uh, there's a bunch of different nations here, the British and the French, so it was great working with all those guys. The Zambian battalion will soon deploy in support of the United Nations multidimensional stabilization mission in the Central African Republic. Sergeant Asa Bingham, Zambia.